Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the Daily Briefing. I have a quick item at the top, and then I'm happy to open it up for questions. Move on. Um, knock them off. Yep. Um, I, I'd like to ask about the detention by the Bahraini government of mm -hmm. Khalil Amarzouk. He's the, um, a senior official in the um, Al-Wahak um, mm -hmm. Al uh, opposition mm -hmm. party, and apparently he was arrested for a you know, for incitement on a speech he gave, but he's someone who's actually in the national dialogue. Mm -hmm. And I um, was just wondering if you have any comment on that. Yep, a couple of points on that. Obviously, we're following the case closely. Uh, we'll be raising it with the Bahraini authorities as part of our discussion of recent political <coughs> developments in Bahrain. I think the bigger context is important here, that we are disappointed that opposition groups have suspended their involvement in the national dialogue that you just mentioned. We believe that the national dialogue is an important step in a longer process that leads to meaningful reforms uh, and that addresses the legitimate aspirations of all Bahrainis. So we'll continue to encourage everyone to participate in okay, it. Okay, but how can you be mm -hmm. disappointed that they don't believe that, they're, that the Bahrainis are operating in good faith if they're arresting people that they're having a dialogue with? Well, I don't have anything further on this specific case. Uh, but we look, we know this national dialogue process is difficult, and nobody's naive about that. I'm going to keep using that word now because you like to focus on it. Um, but we are disappointed that opposition groups have suspended their involvement. We think it's an important forum. We would hope that uh, everybody would be part well, of it. Well, are you process. disappointed that members of the, that the Bahraini regime is arresting people that they're actually supposed to be having a political dialogue We'll with? be raising uh, this case with the Bahraini authorities, as I just said, and I, I just don't have anything further on this specific case. Just, just to make it you used the word naive twice before I ever came out of my lips. And I just want to, ma I want to make sure one, one you thing. You want to go on the record with that? On this, no, no, on Bahrain. On Bahrain? Um, just to put a fine point on this, mm -hmm. you think that the problems that are, or the lack of progress in the national dialogue is due to the opposition? I didn't say that. Oh, that's, I, that's a sweeping I, statement. I want, I'm trying to find out. What, yes. Mm -hmm. Do you think that the reason that the dialogue to date has yet not produced anything is the fault of the opposition. I'm not going to put blame on one side here. We believe that it's an important process. Uh, we're disappointed that the opposition groups have suspended their involvement at this time. And I'm you, just not going to put blame here on where okay, fault lies. But you think that mm -hmm. they should go back? Yes, yes, absolutely. Even though the Bahraini authorities have arrested this guy. Who's we the we believe they should be a part of the process. And well, do you, do, look, do you don't be part of the process? We, we don't support any one person, obviously. I'm not going to speak further on his case. We believe the opposition group should be part of the process. Okay, well, mm -hmm. when you say you're going to be discussing it with his case, you said you, I think you said you I would did. be discussing yes. his case mm -hmm. with the Bahrainis. Well, what will, you, what will you tell them? I don't have any preview of what that message will look like. Have they not been already, has there not already been contact about I, this I don't case? know if we've contacted them on this case specifically. I know we will be raising it. I just don't know if we have. And I, I don't have a preview for what that conversation will look like. Okay. Well, I, it's important to know whether you, you're going to call on the Bahrainis to release this guy or whether you think that uh, this arrest was justified. I understand the question. So, if I have anything further about the message uh, that we'll be uh, giving to the Bahraini government okay. as part of this, this discussion, I, I'm happy to but share it with you if I can. I think the reason that you're getting a kind of surprised looks here is because the Bahrainis have arrested this guy, mm -hmm. and you seem to be, you're, you're upset with the opposition, I not said, with the government. I said we're going to be raising the case with the government, but we also, I, know, but I you took don't, it but back you, a step. But you can't say what it is that you're going to tell the government. I, I, I mean, you I'm could not going say, to preview that based, for you. Right, but based on mm -hmm. that answer, and you're not previewing it, you could go and say, hey, good job. Well done. We think that was a really good move. I would encourage you not move. to make any assumptions well, one way or the other about what we're going to say. Well, but, I mean, don't let them, don't leave, leave it to us to have a, an assumption. If I make it clear if I have to, the, to us and to also share, to the Bahraini government how you think this affects the process. If I have anything further Thank you. on that message, I will share it with you. Share with us engagement with the opposition and at what level in Bahrain? You, yes, uh, I don't have any update for you on that. Let me uh, let me take the question, Saeed, and I'll get you an answer. I just I just don't know what okay, it is. At this point, with the opposition um, withdrawing from the dialogue, mm -hmm. what do the Bahraini authorities have to do to keep the bar dialogue going? Well, uh, I'm not going to lay out specific steps. Obviously, this is dialogue uh, that's internal to but Bahrain. You just, you just said that the opposition has to return. That's a specific we, step. We think that it's an important process. I'm not going to lay out specific uh, markers for the Bahraini government to hit. We just think well, that people should be part of this process. Just as a general rule, though, without mm -hmm. speaking to this particular case, do you think that political detentions 
um, in the middle of a national dialogue are can, are helpful to the climate of a national dialogue? I don't want to speak to the specific case I'm in not, any way, shape, or form, but it's a case specifically case. about Bahrain and the national dialogue. Uh, broadly speaking, I think we've made very clear our concerns uh, with that issue uh, around the world, but I don't want to speak at all further to this specific case. I just don't. So you're, basically the Bahraini government today, from this podium, gets a free pass. You can characterize it any way you want, Matt. I'm not okay. characterizing it that way. Well, I don't expect you to, but that's unfortunately or fortunately, whatever. We're I mean, going that's, to raise it with the that's government. The, that's the impression that you have left on us and on the Bahraini government. And we're, we're going to raise it with the Bahraini government. And I'm going to leave it at that, and we're moving on. But, Mary, I, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm also really befuddled about this Bahrain thing, yeah. because um, when you're in the middle of a dialogue and your leader gets arrested, how can anybody assume that that dialogue can go back to where it was? I, I don't have anything further for you on this case. I know there's a lot of questions about it. Yeah. I'll see if I can get anything more for okay. you, and we can talk but about I it But I don't tomorrow. understand why you're disappointed that the opposition suspended the dialogue when a leader of their opposition is unable to take part. Because we believe that the dialogue is important. We believe that it's an important mechanism and it should go forward, but even though it's hard. I just don't have anything yeah, else for you Yeah, but do you, you believe this. that the dialogue should be just conducted for the sake of dialogue? I mean, when no, there are other instances, not. you just talk about that these can't be talks for the sake of talks. Absolutely not. So why should, you th why should they think that they should just be continuing to have a dialogue if they don't feel that the Bahrainis are in good faith. Because each case is different. Again, I think I've made clear what our position is on the national dialogue. If I have anything further to share with you on the case okay. of this, the person who's been detained, I'm ha we can engage on it tomorrow as well. Are you not disappointed the Bahraini authorities arrested him? I'm not going to use that term. Nope, not on, not on this one. What yeah, is your no, reaction? Well, I, I said we'll be raising it with them. We, we know so you're not going to give us publicly like you do in many other cases? You're not going I to give us publicly reaction to this? I don't have anything additionally, anything today for you on this. If I have anything additional tomorrow, I'm happy to share. I'm sure I'm sure the Bahraini government appreciates the kid gloves uh, approach that you're taking to this. More than I appreciate I've, your helpful commentary. Yeah, well, I'm gonna go I to just North think Korea the point now. needs to be the point needs to be made. Mm -hmm. Let's go to North Thank Korea. You, Thank you. Yep.